Welcome to Airgun Depot's product spotlight. I'm Tyler Patner. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Hatsan AT4410 in 177 caliber. The AT4410 is a high-powered hunting pre-charged pneumatic air rifle with a lot of features. So let's take a look at some of these fine features. We're also going to get to some accuracy testing and some chronic testing. Uh, we're going to see exactly how much power this bad boy is putting out. So let's get into it. The rifle comes with two 10-shot magazines, a fill probe, a degassing tool, an instruction manual, and some spare O-rings and tools. The manual not only details the features of the gun, but takes you step-by-step -step for just about every procedure from loading the magazine to adjusting the trigger. Taking a look at the action, the side lever is smooth and functions quickly for fast follow-up shots. It does have a tendency to snap back after a certain point, but I didn't really find that to be an issue after a lot of use. The rifle functions like this. Pull back on the side lever which cycles the magazine and engages the automatic safety. Next, find your target, take the gun off safe, and pull the trigger. Loading the magazine is quick and easy. Simply slide the pellet into the hole and snug them up with your finger. Then slide the mag into the rifle. The magazine is held in place with the gold catch that you see here. On top of the breech block you'll find a very innovative mounting rail. You can use 11mm or weaver mounts on this rail, which is particularly nice if you happen to purchase a scope that comes with weaver mounts. The gun has open sights if you choose not to scope it. Both the front and rear sight are fiber optic and adjustable. If you happen to pick up see-through mounts you can even use the open sights while you have a scope mounted. The synthetic stock is figured very nicely and is quite comfortable to hold. At around 6.5 pounds and just under 40 inches, the AT44 is very maneuverable and lightweight. My only complaint about the stock is that it is hollow and feels a bit too plasticky for my liking. But the AT44 is also available in a gorgeous Turkish walnut stock. On the plus side though, I definitely wouldn't feel bad about taking the synthetic stock into the woods as it is going to take abuse very well. The gun also has an adjustable butt pad which is really helpful in making the rifle comfortable to shoot for you. The air cylinder is removable, which means you can purchase extra cylinders to keep with you on a hunt or a long day of target shooting. To fill the cylinders, you can use a hand pump or a tank. You can fill without removing the cylinder via the fill probe, or you can remove the tube entirely and fill it that way if you have the proper adapters. I prefer to leave the cylinder on the gun, so I use the probe and have yet to experience any issues. One of the small features that I was really happy to see Hotson include is the small plastic fill hole plug that keeps dust and debris out of your air cylinder when you're using the gun. Really nice feature. On the front of the air tube you'll find a small pressure gauge which reads in bar. The AT44 takes up to a 200 bar or 3000 psi fill. The manual says the 50 full power shots can be expected off of a fill and claims a velocity of 1070 feet per second in 177. One thing I should note is that Hotson tests their rifles with lead pellets, not lightweight alloy, so you can trust their estimated velocities. With 8.4 grain JSP pellets, the AT44 topped out at 1,085 feet per second. Now that's really screaming. Velocity stayed over 1,000 feet per second for more than 35 shots. And to see how much power we could get out of the AT44, I used the 10.3 grain JSP heavies and topped out at 1,016 FPS. Now that's a whopping 23.6 foot pounds of energy, and that's in a 177. I took over 50 shots on the chronograph and used about 90 bar total. It's really nice to finally see a rifle that lives up to and then exceeds the manufacturer's expectations. Alright, so before we get to the accuracy testing, I wanted to talk a little bit about the trigger. This is Hotson's Quattro trigger, and it is a very solid trigger. Uh, it's a little on the heavy side pulling well breaking at about three to four pounds uh, And I prefer to see it lower But for a hunting rifle which this is it pulls very smooth and it breaks clean every time uh, But definitely I would like to see hot on lighten this trigger up I shot many different pellets looking for the best and the three that performed the most consistently for me were the JSB 8.4 grain exacts, the JSB 10.3 grain heavies, and the Crossman Premier Domed from the box at 10.5 grains. For testing, I shot all three pellets at 30 yards in a five shot group. 
the JSB heavies produced a 0.79 inch group. The Premiers produced a group that was just over half an inch and the JSB exacts were tightest with a 0.46 inch group. Considering the super high velocities the AT44 was spitting out, I was very impressed with the accuracy at 30 yards. And for those of you looking to do some long range hunting or target shooting, I'd definitely go with the 22 over the 177. Not only are you going to get more power out of the larger caliber, but I suspect that your accuracy is going to improve at longer ranges as well. Last but certainly not least is going to be the noise factor. The AT44 is not shrouded, but does feature a threaded muzzle end which has half inch UNF threads. Putting these threads to good use may be essential for those of you who plan to shoot in the backyard with neighbors close by, because the AT44 is loud, really loud. So overall, the Hotson AT4410 in 177 caliber is going to get a 4 out of 5 stars from me. Accuracy was a lot better than I expected, especially considering the super high velocities that this gun was spitting out. Uh, and while I do suspect 22 and 25 cal will be even better, this gun's going to get a 5 in accuracy. Ergonomics is going to get a 5 as well. The gun's super comfortable and very easy to handle. It's lightweight, makes it especially pointable, and definitely something you can take out into the field with you. Quietness is going to be a 2. There's no way around it. The AT44 is super loud. But the fact that Hotson did add the threaded muzzle end, it does give it the option of being quieted down. So, a two there. Power, definitely going to have to give it a five there as well. Uh, even though it's a 177, it produced huge numbers, and you're definitely going to have no problem taking down small game with this gun. The trigger, certainly not bad there. Uh, would have preferred to see it be a little lighter. Maybe something match grade in the future would be better for Hotson. Uh, so I'm going to give it a four there. So overall, for the price point, I think the Hotson AT44 is a fantastic choice, especially for you hunters out there. And uh, I would suggest you guys give it a strong look and consideration when you're looking to purchase your next air gun. Uh, I'm Tyler Patner, and this has been Airgun Depot's Product Spotlight. I appreciate you guys for joining me. And for uh, the rest of the Hotson line, as well as the AT4410, you can go to www.airgundepot.com and check it out. Appreciate you guys for joining me. We'll see you at the next one.